Hey guys, Penadaily here, and welcome back to Let's Play. No. <sighs> there. I was trying to hit B. Let's play Castlevania. Aria. Uh, I'm okay. All right, let's play Castlevania Aria of Sorrow Randomizer. Play. Might as well come down here since we have the slide. There's a few things we can do because there is one. Uh, an, this uh, randomizers also kind of test your knowledge of the castle. Ooh, beef curry. That is a full heal, which I think I said last time. So yeah, we're we're now in the study, forbidden area. Yeah, yeah. This is probably going to be a shorter LP than my last one, so uh, who knows how long it's going to take me. Um, most people, when they do randomizer runs, they do them as speed runs. I'm not doing a speed run. I'm not good at speed running. My, my main skill is, you know, being thorough and knowing everything, including stupid stuff. And throwing caps at my enemies. Because cats. Sorry, Yoko. <sighs> These guys have a very odd hitbox, I gotta say. Ow. I will get these, ah, the timing on these guys right. Someday. Maybe. More milk. It does a body good. Not mine, though. I am, I do not. <clears throat> I'm not sure, did I ever tell you guys? When I was a kid, I was actually allergic to milk. Uh, <clears throat> as I got older, I grew out of that, but I still... For a long time, I had sort of uh, intolerance to it. <clears throat> Didn't digest it well. Now, I can digest it fine, but I hate it. I mean, when you spend a good, you know, 15 to 20 years of your life knowing that... Super potion! Very nice. Knowing that something is going to make you violently ill, you tend to not care for the taste, so... No milk. Do not like milk. If you want to know how I get my calcium, I like broccoli. Go figure. And spinach. I actually really like spinach. Hello, boss fight. Yeah, interestingly enough, this armor boss fight. I'm going to just spam kitties at you until I run out. Then I will hit you with my sword. Okay, now I will hit you with my sword. Really? Right, this is the wrong sword to use. How do you work? Nope. Yeah, this is another thing, you know. We're gonna use the lance, which I don't normally like, but... As you notice, it's slow, but it's doing roughly the same amount of uh, damage to him as the kitties did. And it gets past his guard. Ah. You know what? Let's use, a, let's use that milk I just picked up. I'm not good at using the back dash. I know I'm not. Yeah, I don't actually have to crouch. Didn't really need to use that milk. Oh well. You never know. Hi, Hammer. Bye, Hammer. Shop's unlocked. Silk robe. I was... Yeah, this is my first armor! Okay, I'm going back to the katana. The lance is powerful, but I don't like it. And, and it's, uh... 
particular arc can be very useful. But I don't like how it goes. Okay. Oh, you're, you know, that, that, that's just not right. That's so not right. Murdering you. Oh good, you die now in one shot. That's much less annoying. Uh, so, uh, one thing about Dracula Souls is they will always be found as, uh, findable items. So Student Witch could be a Dracula Soul in this game. Right. <sighs> so yes, it could be that one of the Dark Lord's ancient powers is the power of kitties. After all, we have not yet seen... The red book. We've only seen the yellow book. The red fairy book. Ah, one nice thing about the katana is how much easier it makes freaking flea men. Die. Thank you. Alright, so now we're gonna go up to that warp point. Checking the map? Yep, we've done everything down here. <sighs> Gotta love it. Uh, one nice thing with bone pillars is as long, once you take out the bottom, uh, if, if you're killing bone pillars with one of these swords, uh, an overhead swing sword, like the broadsword or the katana, you die, you die now. If you're killing them with one of those, well, they are considerably son of a biscuit. Uh, going up this place is never as easy as... You know what, I'll take that, thanks. Never as easy as going down. Alright, so. Yeah, so, of course, normally you would have gotten Malfast the double jump and ha in uh, the room where Hammer is and used it to. come down here. Or come up here. Oh, really? Jesus. I am not having the best luck today. Oh well, there we go. <laughs> oh, I love Student Witch. I never got Student Witch. I mean, I don't think I got it at all in my first playthrough in, in my first seed so you know I'm already happy <sighs> but yeah as I said um, you uh, heck just using the Lancer the Lancer the Lance on the um, the uh, great armor instead of I don't think I've ever actually used a final guard soul either. I should try that. Try that out. Okay. Ha! There we go. Okay, you do want to come up here as soon as you can to see whether or not it's worth dealing with that thing in the middle that you can only get when you get the bat soul. Because if it's just like money, uh, that is the Ascalon, I think. That's not a bad soul. But yeah, that's for batter hippogriffs, so. 
But yeah, the, the reason if I never said, which, you know, ADHD, the reason I did not, I do not use the tracker is that it eats resources like freaking candy. So we're gonna go meet Hammer and his shop. Yep. Let's see if there's anything I want to sell him. Yes. I'm gonna get rid of the broadsword and the scimitar. Keeping the lance, I'm gonna get rid of the cestus and the mock punch. Keeping the handgun, actually, I think. Selling our... Yeah. Selling that skull necklace. All right, let's see what he's got for sale. Man sells super potions. Okay then. And tasty meat, which is nice. Uh, we don't need the Danes left. Eh, the final sword. I bought that. It was not. It was not bad. Oh, the K. The Oni Kitty is not as good as what we've got. Cool. The K. K Tar and Spear, Lance, Cestus, War Fatigues. I mean, that's better. This is all better armor. What have we got? Let's see. The ninja suit's better. The steel plate's really good. Black belt. Flame necklace. Yeah, some, a lot of these are things that you really don't maybe get. Um, do I want the steel plate? It drops my end, but I don't care about end. Yes. Okay. And we're going to equip the steel plate. And, uh, oh. Talk to Mina. Okay. It's just her usual. And she's a full heal. Okay, so now that we've got double jump, <laughs> it's time to head to the dance hall, as, as you normally would. Yeah, you can play this. You can have the story in this if you want. It's not, it's Link, like, Link's the Past randomizers, they actually, well, I guess the one that everybody plays, it changes a lot of the text. We're not bothering with that, so. So yeah, the, um, the room right. Really? Uh, there we go. This room, we go up to the dance hall. Oh, hey! Armor's drop potions. Good to know. Hammer Shop does not get an upgrade um, after death. Uh, you know, after you fight death. I should have kiddied him. Oh, no. That's what I thought. Okay, this is this is just gonna get me the money, but money. Uh, the other way you can tell that a um, that it's a real bag of money is if it does that sort of glimmer thing. Mimics don't do that. So, we're going to fight our way through the sirens. Alright. Alright. Yeah, a lot of people don't know that the sirens, as described in the Odyssey, were bird women, not fish women. Also, the, uh, the, the siren, you know, the thing that you hear on a police car and stuff. Hi, Julius. Bye, Julius. It's called the siren because it sings in water. That's, the guy, he did an electric, something with an electric current and a metal plate. I can't remember exactly how it was made, but it sings in water. And so it was, he called it a siren. Oh, hey. We're gonna go up there f first because it might be something extremely useful. It's a blue one. Transforming into a bat gives you the ability to fly. 
pause for maniacal laughter here. No, you mean seriously. Uh, yeah. Mm, Hippogriff Soul is the... There's absolutely... Great Sword. Okay, that's what that is, not the Ascalon. So there now there's absolutely no reason to go up that other tower. Good to know! And we leveled up. Have a kitty. Use this guy as a scratching post, kitties. Yeah, those wooden golems are tanky. I don't like you. I've never liked you. You, on the other hand, I like a lot for your soul. And the fact that you don't curse me in this freaking game. I really like that you don't curse me in this game. <laughs> Hit a guy with enough kitties and he dies. Grief. Uh, okay, well, since the game seems to be trying to tell us something. Oh, it's not that much. Yeah, the, the, oh, I'm getting to like these overhead, uh, swords more than I thought I would. Eh. Hello, nurse. That's not what I wanted. That is what I wanted. Yay! I'm not as not as strong, not as tanky, but that's gonna up my. Yeah, the the con the fact that you keep seeing the uh, flying armor appear when it really shouldn't. Uh, that's that's because I I have played the other seed so much. And uh, got really used to going everywhere with Black Panther Soul. Hi, mind up! Very nice! Ow. Ow again. There we go. This is a pretty nice sword. But yeah, give it... Really? Oh. oh. I'm gonna just sit right here and kill you guys. And get lots of health, or health, uh, magic back. I'm I'm not bothering with the killer dolls as much as I love them. I won't they You can uh one of the things is you can get Caledbolg. Not much use right now. Very useful at the end of the game. Nice. Oh, I do love my kitties. Yep. I love the fact that they will go through an enemy and hit the one behind him. I never have the kind of luck soul at this point to uh, grind the Tsuchinoko, so I generally don't. It's not like... Um, who knows what he'll drop? He could drop something stupid. Or something great. Do like the arc on this sword. Thank <laughs> you. 
surprisingly well. Sorry, I got... <sighs> this mirrored um, texture bit right here. D d does that look wrong to anyone else? We get the partisan. He dropped a ninja suit. Okay, I'm glad I didn't buy one. Drops my defense by eight. Ugh, nah. What am I at? 21 minutes. Okay. Yeah, I'm thinking this is going to be a much faster... Uh, let's save. You know, to be safe. You don't want to lose anything. Alright, come on. Alright. Ow! Jerk. Ugh, dead warrior. Like, I want that soul. You can die, and you can die. And you can die of kitty. I love kitties. Oof. There we go. Kill you. And you. Ah. Alright. I don't remember hitting the jump button, but I'm, I'm good for it. We're good with it. I do love the multiple hits that the cats do. Alright, now we go this way. All right, yep, those zombie officers are not nearly as much of a problem as they are in vanilla runs. We'll come back that way. Just stand here, wait for the guy to come at you. Maybe throw a cat at him. 23 minutes, I'm just ignoring you. Okay, now, trying to kill this lady with a lance is a pain in the tuchus. Trying to kill her with a broadsword, or with a greatsword, much easier. So, now we have opened that up. Damn. There we go. Nemesis. Goddess of Vengeance. Ah, <sighs> so yeah, I had said that my um next LP was going to be Luigi's Mansion. And obviously, it isn't. I need more time to practice that because I'm really not good at it, and I'm not entirely sure if I'm even going to do it. I might not be able to beat it. I'm I'm. I've died several times, which usually isn't, I mean, that's not unheard of, but yeah, I may not do Luigi's Mansion until next, or I might even wait longer. Saving. I'm, I know there are people who'd like to see it, like to see me do it, but, um, I just, you know, I have to be sure I can beat it first, and that may don't forget, those guys' tails are a hitbox, too. Oh, now that's interesting. I didn't realize the cats could hit... were hitting the wall's hitbox. Grunting. 
not as good. And honestly... Yeah. I like you. I love your soul. I mean, who doesn't like to throw blazing hot curry at enemies? So, either my next LP will be Luigi's Mansion, because I'm going to keep practicing it, or it'll be, um, there's a Zelda classic, and now I've completely blanked on its title. Um, it'll be, but it'll be one of those two. Because I still need to, I need to practice Bloodstained before I do it, too, so, uh, yeah. There have been games that I've done that once I once I got into them, I didn't have to actually finish them. Spoiled milk. Pudding! I didn't have to actually finish the game to be sure I could actually play it for you guys. Like Okami. Having watched enough playthroughs and played it as far as I did, I didn't have to finish it myself to know I could. And even so, I still couldn't 100% it. But uh, Luigi's Mansion, I just... There are a couple things that really are going to give me trouble, unfortunately. Uh, you get over here, please. Here! Katobo boss, Katobo boss, Katobo boss! There we go. Specifically, okay, there are two follow the, um, basically, uh, what's it called? Uh, well, find the three-card Monty-style boss fights. Um, I don't mind, like, spot the differences, which is what, like, the final, the final boss fight with King Boo is. But there's two which are just about, oh, crap. Alright. I mean, it's just money. I guess I don't care. That looked weird there for a second. <sighs> I just love that guy. Anyway, well, screw you too, dude. And I got Gladiator Soul! Not sure which one I got that from either. Oh well. Well, you know what? I want to check the, um... Let's see. Not White Dragon. Quetzal Quetzalcoatl. He is a recon... Okay, so his soul is the yellow one we need. Good to know. Two cats and a sword slash will kill that guy. Awesome. Anyway, like I said, find the lady slash three card Monty. Uh, we're almost 30 minutes. I'm going to call it here. I'm, but I'm not good at those styles of boss fights. I, my spatial reasoning is, well, it's fine, but I'm not good at following um, fast movement. And in one, the lights go out and you have to um, predict where the hats are moving, and yeah, I suck at that really, really bad. So, uh, yeah, we won't be, d I may or may not be doing that game at all. So, thank you guys for joining me for Let's Play Aria of Sorrow Randomizer, and I will see you next time. Have a great evening. Goodbye.